Um, I'm Tayo, Tayo Shofeso, and um, I'm one of the City Data Project Officers. I'm Claire Taylor, I'm one of the City Data Officers. I work in the data team uh, in the City Technology Platform. Um, yeah, um, my specialism is in um, geographical um, spatial analysis. Um, so what that entails is um, working with the um, geographical data sets that the council have and that ranges from um, transportation data sets like the cycle routes, um, the bus lanes, or even m the car parks, and even talking about just Glasgow administrative boundaries. So. I was interested in the programme because I'd recently retrained as a statistician and I was very interested in the idea of a, like open data and, and big data. Most people think that a statistician is t to do with bean counting. Um, and although we do that, um, one of the things that we do is we do actually check data. It's a major part of any statistician's job is to check data, is to check that it's complete and to check that it's accurate. So you, you look at what, how the data is, cons uh, how it's made up, and if there's any missing data, or if there's stuff that's obviously, that's obviously wrong. Um, I work with um, such data sets, and then what I do is um, I pre perform special analysis on them in terms of um, just fetching up the data and um, cropping it according to Glasgow administrative boundaries. and. Um, providing that information on the data portal, making sure that the standards are put into place um, in terms of how the data is described, in terms of um, getting written procedures in place, having a metadata, a data management plan in place to ensure um, the integrity of the data and to make sure that the data is communicated um, broadly to the public and is not misinterpreted in any way. Um, so I do, I do a lot of um, stuff like that and um, also I do a lot of um, talking to people, getting them to open their data sets, explain to them what the benefits um, are um, once the data is made open. A dream data set would be one where, um, that's available, <laughs> where somebody says to me, here is the data, yes I'll sign the release forms and I'm perfectly happy um, with signing these release forms. That's the very first point. The second point is then uh, what the data set uh, is, is, looks like and that's, when I say all the fields, I mean there's no empty boxes anywhere. That sounds simple but quite often we get things and there's empty boxes all over the place and it makes it, it, makes it harder harder to use. So a complete data set um, and it's not much use if it's not accurate. The next thing is timely, so I'm actually asking for quite a lot, I'm asking for complete, uh, accurate and timely because some data sets that are 10 years old aren't much use whereas there could be other data sets that 10 years old might be really quite interesting.